So, as you know, I have a fetish. Let's be honest. I do. Your iPhone. <laughs> you, can't, you can't make your phone a fetish. No, my phone is not fetishized, but my handbags are. Yes. And, uh, <laughs> and uh, uh, apparently people know that, right? And our, Ron G., who is a, a kind of a, a, we talk on Telegram, um, sent me a, a picture of his bag. He says, first of all, it's not a handbag. It's a travel bag from Duluth Trading Company. You've probably all heard of Duluth. I'm wearing their underwear right now. I'm wearing their underwear right now, says Clayton Morris. It's a great place. I love it. Well, they make this travel bag. It's about 150 bucks. So here's what I've been carrying. And I, I love my, you know, it all came about because my keychain was so big, it was giving me sciatica. I was having nerve issues in my leg from a giant... The same reason I got their underwear. <laughs> <laughs> so, and then I happened to see this. I was in San Diego at the Coronado, and they have a nice leather store, and I saw this bag, and I said, I have to have it. It's just kind of like a saddlebag. But, and I love it. It's made of hornween leather. It's beautiful, but it doesn't have any any real pouches in it, and that's been kind of a problem. So I've been carrying it around, and I like it, but I want some more organization. This is this is uh, the, uh, it's less expensive. Uh, this is the Duluth Trading Company travel bag, and this has zippers and pouches galore. In fact, it even has, which I really like, and the reason I'm making a pick on MacBreak Weekly, a special neoprene padded pouch suitable for an iPad. Let me see if I can get this open. Have I already broken it? No, there it is. So you could put the iPad in this... Uh, neoprene padded pouch um, but that's not the that's not the last of it there's pouches uh, all over the place extra little zipper pouches here and there you can store everything and you know once you start carrying a bag and I warn you uh, don't you start carrying a lot of stuff in your bag like headphones and you know USB keys with varieties of operating systems and pens and so forth should I try the iPad Pro I doubt the Pro would fit in there this is I think more for a, a the new iPad Pro, but let me let me just see if it. Well, I take it back. No, see, it's it's not going to fit in the neoprene pouches. Too big for uh, for. But this is too big for anything, frankly. The iPad Pro. But it would fit a regular uh, iPad in there just fine, or a mini. Uh, and if, I should try it with a MacBook because that's one thing I do carry around a lot. So just a you know my newest fetish object. It's not a purse. It's a travel bag. And it's from the Duluth Trading Company. They make nice stuff. It really... Uh, it's European. It's European carry-all. Uh, really nicely made. And uh, and it's got a handle, which my other one didn't. I like it. So there's my pick. I did that for Andy, because Andy's always doing stuff like that. Bags and, you know, dresses. Stuff like that. And it is, of course, made from leather from happy cows. Uh, har harvested from cows that were already dead. I don't know. So... Uh, <laughs> If you're a vegan, I apologize. No, they didn't skin them alive. That's good. They didn't skin them alive. <laughs> they were already knocked out.